Hey guys, this is your host Hitesh Malviya and welcome once again to my YouTube channel. In today's episode of Crypto Market Outlook, I will discuss technical analysis of Bitcoin and Ethereum. At the same time, I will also share a couple of promising trading setups with you and also I will share a couple of key tips you should consider which can actually help you to identify these potential setups by your own. So make sure you watch this video till the end because this video is going to be very helpful for you if you are an active trader or investor in crypto market. And also make sure you subscribe my YouTube channel and click on bell icon and also check out all the videos which I have created previously. Crypto market has been doing the relief rally since past couple of days. Bitcoin is almost up by 40% from its bottom. Ethereum is up by almost 80% from its bottom. Matic is already double its value since it found bottom a uh, couple of days back. So ultimately the market is doing good and there is a relief in the market. At the same time yesterday we saw a negative news coming from the market when Tesla announced their quarter two results and they announced in the feeling that they have sold 75% of their Bitcoin holdings and they have occurred a loss of 936 million dollar uh, if you re revisit the previous tweets of Elon Musk back dated at 19 May 2022 you will find he uh, tweeted like that Tesla has diamond hands and at that time Bitcoin was trading around 29 thousand dollars so there is a speculation in the market that he might have sold uh, before actually posting that tweet on Twitter right so he might have sold uh, Bitcoin at uh, price level around $29,000. Regarding Elon Musk, I'm thinking like that guy is not to be trusted anymore, right? So now if you're already seeing that he is backing out from his Twitter buyout deal as well, right? By citing different reasons about spamming data and all. So he got his different reasons and he also got a different influence. A lot of people are uh, used to follow him a lot and they also getting influence a lot. Last year when he announced that Tesla bought Bitcoin, Bitcoin price really like 70% in a day last year but now if when he announced that Tesla has sold 75% of his holding Bitcoin price has not tumbled here and it only saw a correction of 7% which is a good thing that market is not in the influence of Tesla and uh, Elon Musk tweets anymore that is an amazing thing and uh, that is also creating a very healthy environment and that is also creating a very less scope of manipulation which we don't need at this time right now because we already have a lot of negative sentiments around the market in regards to economic data and all. So this is a relief uh, and I was very happy to see the price action of Bitcoin after the tweet has been released and after the data has been released from Tesla fillings. So that was quite satisfactory for me personally. Now let's look at the technicals of Bitcoin if, and if you look at the daily chart of Bitcoin you will find Bitcoin is just trading about $22,000 and Bitcoin has found rejection at $24,000 and which was actually the initial rejection which I already mentioned in my previous video of Bitcoin price action and so $24,000 was the initial level where rejection possibility was there and Bitcoin rejected from that level and the next re resistance level would be around $27,000 and the major area of resistance would be in range of $27,000 to $29,000 and $29,000 is going to be key and pivotal uh, resistance level for Bitcoin because that is also the level from Bitcoin broke down after the sales news arrived and that is also the market retest for Bitcoin. As of now on the technical part Bitcoin has found support above 50 moving average, 50 simple moving average which is a bullish sign uh, in a bull market of short term or long term a price support above 50 MA is generally considered as a bullish sign for a uh, any asset and Bitcoin has found that and currently it is trading above 50 MA. So as long the price stay above 50 MA, I think the price can revisit $27,000 very soon in the upcoming time. So that is uh, what I think about Bitcoin and if you look at the chart of Ethereum, things are same with Ethereum as well. But here the Ethereum is ahead in the terms of price action because of the fundamentals with Ethereum. Ethereum is going to have Ether2 merge in September which is a very strong fundamental for not only for Ethereum but also it is from the whole crypto market. It is going to be one of the biggest technical events in the crypto ever happened. So I have uh, created a, another video on Ether2 merge. Uh, I have, will drop the link in the description. You can check it out and you will find what is all about Ether2 merge and why this is a big deal for Ether and why Ether price can really more so ethereum is leading the rally here ethereum is already trading above 50 ma it is already found support above 50 moving average which is bullish sign 
and ethereum is almost close to the market retest level the market retest level for ethereum is almost around 1700 dollar to 1800 dollar ethereum price is currently trading above 1500 dollar so i think uh, as long the price stay above 1450 dollar we can see ethereum to rally towards 1800 dollar it might extend its rally to 2000 dollar as well because ethereum is more bullish than bitcoin right now right so ethereum is more bullish because of the fundamentals and also the technical are looking way better than bitcoin at this current stage so uh, if you want to choose between ethereum and bitcoin at this point i think you can choose ethereum ethereum has better price action ethereum has better fundamentals and ethereum can give you more returns as compared to bitcoin at this stage in a bear market in a bear cycle you will see all coins drop at the same time right all coins from all sort of category whether it is a gaming coin or whether it is a nft coin metaverse coin they will all drop at the same time along with Bitcoin and Ethereum. But when it comes to bull cycle, not all coin really at the same time, right? The money will flow from blue chips to mid cap to low cap and also the money will flow category wise. Sometimes you will find only play to one gaming coins are moving. Sometimes you will find only NFT based coins are moving, right? So this kind of uh, money flow always happen in cryptocurrency industry and historically we have identified that. So you need to identify uh, which category based coins are currently moving on different exchanges and which category based coins are having high trading volume. After you identify the category which is generally having a great trading interest and uh, in that category couple of coins are doing great price performance then you need to identify that which are those coins in the, that particular category which has not started the rally yet by doing that you can find the laggers and once you identify the laggers there is a good chance that you can get into the right coin and you can find a potential promising setup right so that is the one of the way to identify the setups and the second way once you already find which are those coins which has already done a great rally for example in the two days time matic has done a great rally right so then you need to identify what are those patterns which actually played in that technical chart on daily time frame and weekly time frame which actually give push on technical side to that particular coin and that is why they have given that particular rally to it, investors right so for matic once you look at the daily chart of matic you will find uh, we spotted a 21 ma and 50 ma bullish crossover on that daily chart right that is one of the pattern which was responsible for that rally which we have seen in matic so far and matic can also rise more from here and after you uh, look at that weekly chart you will find there was an ascendant triangle was in play right and uh, matic price broke out from that ascending triangle and then it rallied uh, 30 to 40 percent after that right and i also mentioned the similar pattern in my previous video on matic i created that video on matic when the matic price was uh, trading below 0.55 dollar right then i mentioned this technical chart their fundamentals and all so, and after you see this technicals you need to also look out for the different news ar around that coin whether the fundamental are bullish or not whether they have released some sort of bullish news or not so matic has released a couple of bullish news they have released uh, jk evm yesterday they also released announcement on different partnership from disney to reddit in past couple of days so fundamental wise matic was very bullish it was super bullish so as of now if you ask me which are the pattern you should look out to identify this potential setup i will say i should look out for 21 ma and 50 ma bullish crossover you need to find out which are those potential chart on daily time frame it's where you are seeing a bullish crossover between 21 simple ma and 50 simple ma 21 simple ma and 51 simple ma bullish crossover is generally a very good uh, pattern to get it early in this uh, potential bull run right so i have traded this uh, pattern for so long and I, I can say like it works almost 80 percent of the time it worked for me most of the time so on binance uh, at this point of time you will find the similar 21 ma 50 ma bullish crossover on app coin you will find the similar pattern on uh, ens you will find the similar pattern on uniswap and after you find this for pattern and also you can also look out for the another pattern which was identify 
on uh, matic which was ascending triangle and similar triangles which are generally bullish so you can also look out for these triangles you can also look out for 21 and 50 m bullish crossover so appcoin ens uniswap are having this sort of patterns and these three setups are bullish right now and also at the same time appcoin is also having great fundamentals because of their ongoing developments on other side deed and also if you ask about ens ens is having a great fundamentals because a uh, massive sales activities is happening on ENS domains they are making a lot of revenue on daily basis and if you ask about Uniswap, Uniswap is beast right now they are making on average of 7 million dollar fees per day and they are making more fees than Ethereum that is massive man that is amazing so Uniswap is going to be the best play uh, in my opinion in both short term and long term so I think if you are a value investor then I think you should look into Uniswap you can read more about Uniswap how it works and what is their future projection and everything and also you can look out their data on uh, fees and all and also also create a detailed fundamental analysis on Uniswap very soon so I believe for a value investor Uniswap is amazing investment options right now and if you can hold it for three to four years it has great potential in my opinion that is how you can find this uh, great trading setup by identifying this pattern from the early winners and you need to find these laggers and once you find the laggers you need to support the same patterns and you need to support the positive news and all then I think you can get a great trading setup and you can make good money in short term and long term and as long this market is concerned I think we are in the relief really right, right now we are not in the bull market we will be in the bull market after only Bitcoin find support above, above $30,000 again and uh, I think that will take some time so by the time I think we are in the relief rally and relief rally can take up to a couple of days like 9 days 10 days let's see how far it goes but at the same time I think we should not be overexposed into cryptocurrency at short term right now because uh, the fundamental is still negative and GDP data will coming out by the end of this month so after that we might see the news of recession will hit and US may officially announce that they are in recession so that might affect the market again I will keep sharing more insight on market in next videos and I will also create a couple of fundamental analysis on different coins so make sure you subscribe to my youtube channel and also click on bell icon so you don't miss any updates and uh, also let me know your thoughts in the comments and let me know what do you think about the market and how do you find this video so yeah that is all from my side thank you